most gracious God of infinite charity that hath loved all mankind. You gave us in your child the best pledge of your love that once made him a man in the womb of a virgin and born in a manger for our health and cure. I, on behalf of all mortals, give you infinite thanks for so sovereign benefit. In exchange of him, I will offer the poverty, humility, and other virtues of your incarnated Son. I beseech you for his divine merits, for the discomforts of his birth, and the tender tears he shed in the manger. Also prepare our hearts with deep humility, passion, and with such contempt of all earthly things, so that the newborn Jesus has in them his crib and dwell forever. Amen. Prayer to Saint Joseph O oh, blessed Joseph, husband of Mary and foster father of Jesus, infinite thanks be to God that has chosen you for as sovereign mysteries and adorned you with all the gifts provided to so excellent greatness. I beseech you for the love you had to the divine child. Hold me in earnest wishes to see him and receive him sacramentally while I see his divine essence and joy in heaven. Amen. Joy of Discovery The joy of discovery that moment when hope and expectation were gloriously met by the illumination of one bright star. We cannot imagine what words were spoken by visitors or if first impressions left them somewhat confused. Messiah, Savior, a king born in the barest of palaces. Yet they saw and fell down on their knees in adoration. Lord, they saw you and knew whom they had met. As we meet around creep, candle or advent, red draw us into that stable in our imagination. In the quiet moments of prayer this Christmas, that brief oasis from the postal of the world bring alive to us the smell of the hay, the sound of the animals, the cry of a baby. Draw us close to our Savior, Messiah and King, as we bring not gold, mere or frankincense, but the gift of our lives, the only offering we can bring. I am there. Now God says to us what he has already said to the earth as a whole through his grace-filled birth. I am there. I am with you. I am your life. I am 
your time. I am the gloom of your daily routine. Why will you not hear it? I weep your tears. Pour yours out to me. I am your joy. Do not be afraid to be happy. Ever since I wept, joy is the standard of living. That is really more suitable than the anxiety and grief of those who have no hope. I am the blind alley of all your paths, for when you no longer know how to go any farther, then you have reached me, though you are not aware of it. I am in your anxiety, for I have shared it. I am in the prison of your finiteness, for my love has made me your prisoner. I am in your death, for today I began to die with you, because I was born, and I have not let myself be spared any real part of this experience. I am present in your needs. I have suffered them, and they are now transformed. I am there. I no longer go away from this world. Even if you do not see me now, I am there. My love is unconquerable. I am there. It is Christmas. Like the candles, they have more right to exist than all the darkness. It is Christmas. Christmas that lasts forever. The memory to the child Jesus prayer. Remember, O oh most sweet child Jesus, you say to the venerable Margaret of the Blessed Sacrament, and through her to all your devotees, these words so comforting for our poor, burdened, and suffering humanity. Anything you want to ask, ask for it by the merits of my childhood, and nothing will be denied. Full of confidence in you, O oh Jesus, that you are the same truth, we come to lay before all our misery. Help us to lead a holy life, to get a blessed eternity. Grant us, by the infinite merits of your childhood, the grace of which we need both. We surrender to you, O oh, omnipotent boy. We are confident that you will not miss our hope and that under your divine promise you will welcome and favorably dispatch our prayer. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. 
Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. <laughs>